welcome to today's video. I thought I would vlog today. I'm currently on my way to get Landon a haircut. Can you say hi? No. No, nope. okay. Landon's getting a haircut. My mom leaves tomorrow, so I need to get him a haircut before she leaves because I don't know the next time I'll be able to get a haircut since with COVID and everything, they're still requiring only one person attend with minors. And you know, I have Asher, so um, we're getting a quick haircut. Um, he has had a man bun for a while now, but he's over the man bun already. He doesn't want his hair in a ponytail. He just always has his hair like this now. And it don't look cute like that. So we're gonna go get him a haircut. Um, but yeah, we're also, I also have to go to the Dollar Tree quick. Um, I have to get a condolence card for our friend. His grandfather just passed away. So we wanna make sure we send him some love. I thought I would vlog. We're actually getting our basement started today. So the guys are actually there right now who are doing our basement. Um, they're just waiting on the wood to be delivered from Lowe's. But they are doing that today. And I'll show you guys some updates on the wood. And not the wood. <laughs> some updates on the basement since we are finishing the basement. We're so excited. Um, we're gonna have like an actual like rec room, a bedroom slash office and bathroom downstairs. So it'll be super nice. Um, we're excited. Um, don't mind my face because I have no makeup on. I wore like a full face of makeup yesterday and I felt amazing. And then today I'm like, nah, showered and just like, nah, no makeup. So yeah, we'll take you along on our day today. Say hi. No, still in the high. So we just got his haircut. We ended up keeping the man bun because when it came time to chopping it, he said no. Can you show your hair? Cute. When it came to actually like cutting, she like did the sides and then when it came to the top, he was like, no cut, no cut. So I was like, okay, you don't want to cut? You like it? Yeah. yeah. He didn't want the top cut anymore. So I was like, okay, fine. Um, so we kept it. The blue pop. What? Dada. You gotta call him? Yeah, call Dada. But he's sleeping. Hmm? He's sleeping. No, Dada. He, Dada's sleeping? No, Dada. <laughs> he's sleeping. No, Dada. Oh, bro, Dada. You gotta call Dada? Yeah. Okay. to Duncan and then go to the bank. I had to get a cashier's check um, for deposit, not deposit, um, phase two of our basement. So I have to give him a check for the next phase. And unfortunately, um, what happened? What? It's okay, put it back on. <laughs> um, so we were doing personal checks but I guess it's taking too long to clear on his end so he asked for a cashier's check which makes sense but it's just more of a pain for me because now I have to actually physically take the kids in the car and then go out and get the check um I have not been out with both kids by myself 
um, in an actual store or anything. Uh, I put them in the car and gone places, but we stayed in the car. But this time I actually have to go into the store, which I don't know how that's gonna work since like with COVID and everything, um, I do have a cover for Asher and he'll stay in the car seat and I plan on putting Landon in the other car, in the, in the stroller, um, I have a double stroller, so they'll just stay in the stroller. Um, I have a little mask for Landon that we used when we went to get his hair cut. Um, so, I'll put that in there. Um, I don't know, I'm hoping for the best. I have his tablet, so I'm hoping that he kind of just stays still. Typically, they're using the drive-thru for a lot more things. Um, because of COVID and they're trying to limit everyone inside the lobby. Um, but I'm pretty, but I'm pretty, pretty positive. You still need to go inside for a cashier's check since that needs to be through the teller and stuff. So I don't, I don't know. Um, but I promised Landon will go get donuts first. Cause that's usually him and Cameron's thing. Um, and it's been a while since he's gotten a donut. Um, so the basement person is doing the plumbing today. So he's actually has a jackhammer, the, um, to move the drain and then move the toilet downstairs because everything's pre-plumbed but basically it's plumbed in such a weird area so it doesn't make sense and it'll make everything like super close together so he's going to move the toilet out and he's moving the shower drain to the opposite end um, since we did a stand-up shower instead of a shower tub combo um, so he's going to be jackhammering and he's like you know what, it's perfect that you're leaving he's like if you want to get any anything else done it'd be great because it is pretty loud um, Yes, Landon? Um, it's typically Asher's nap time right now. He usually goes down around 8.30. Um, so I'm hoping that he sleeps. And this is good that he sleeps because um, with the jack hammering, he probably won't sleep. Um, he's been pretty good with sleeping throughout all the noise with the basement. But um, he has been teething and cutting teeth. And so he's been a little miserable sometimes. Yeah, so they're doing that. So... Asher has been with Asher is super fussy all last week um, but he's actually starting he had, had two good nights so far um, and I think his tooth finally like cut through it feels like it's finally out so I think maybe he's not in as much pain uh, we've been doing a lot of like frozen like fruits and stuff and frozen um, butternut squash that I made so he's been eating that and I feel like that's kind of helping like numb the area almost but yeah so we're gonna get donuts wanna get donuts a donut? Yeah. yeah? Say donut, donut. Mm. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm also going to get some donuts for the guys, too. Um, just a good little, like, thanks, surprise. I don't know. Okay, so I got um, the new, um, what is this? Peach passion fruit drink that they have. Apparently has, like, green tea. Um, so it's supposed to be, like, energy without, like, the shakes of, like, that caffeine or, like, that caffeine the coffee can give you. So let's try this out. I'm so excited. You can definitely taste like the green tea extract in it. It's a little sweet. It's good. I like this. I love green tea. And I love peach green tea, so this is really good. Passion fruit, peach. It's really, really good, but it's definitely sweet. So I feel like if I was to get this again, I would get a little bit of water in this. Or maybe like once I drink a little bit, I'll add some water, but it's really good. So now Landon is eating his munchkins. Is it good? Is it good? Oh, okay. Um, so I'm going to try to head to end now and I don't know how I'm going to do this, but I'm going to attempt to. So I'll let you know how it goes. Hey. Look at this tea. Stop hitting him in the head. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's the next day. I honestly don't even remember what I filmed yesterday, to be honest. I just know I told you guys I went to the bank. 
um, I'm at Duncan again um, to get another one of those passion peach tea things. They're so good. They might get a large this time. No, I probably should still stay with the medium because it has caffeine in it. Um, yeah, um, I think I'm gonna get one of those again. I'm gonna get some more donuts because yesterday I didn't get any donuts for myself and I kind of really wanted one. So today I'm craving a donut. So I'm gonna get one for myself. So I just picked up this um, from someone in my neighborhood. Um, it's the milk dust lactation and weight loss, weight loss plant-based protein. Um, someone in my neighborhood was getting rid of it for free. Um, she said it works um, and she only used like two scoops out of it or something like that. Um, but she's no longer breastfeeding, so she no longer needs it. Um, so I've been really wanting to buy it, but it's like $50. So I was like, let me get this and um, try it out. And then if I like it enough, I'll continue buying it. But I love lactation drinks. I love different kinds of lactation drinks just because I love in, um, I love enhancing my milk supply. What? You want what? Huh? A dog? We have three at home. We don't need any more. Um, but yeah, so, um, I'm excited to try that. I love different lactation drinks. I love enhancing my milk supply. Um, and you know, like when you're on your period and stuff, your milk supply dips. So those are usually times where I really like to um, drink more lactation drinks or like if baby's been teething, could be nursing a lot more just to keep up with my milk supply. Um, but yeah, I got that and I'm excited. Um, we're gonna go to Dunkin' quick, go back home, work, um, you know, typical day. I think this is nice for us to leave the house too, even if it's just going to Dunkin', just for land, just to be in the car, different scenery, doing something else, but yeah. So we're gonna get a drink, get some donuts. That's that. So update with the basement. The basement looks really, really good. Um, they're completely finished. They're actually not working in the basement anymore right now. I'm waiting for my permits, uh, I'm waiting for my plan my blueprint to be approved so I could pull my permit so then I can go and do drywall next but obviously I want the electrical plumbing and everything to be inspected first to make sure everything's good to go and then um, go and get my permit and go to drywall on Thursday hopefully we can still do drywall on Thursday I'm hoping so part of me is super stressed out right now because Landon spilt finger paint all over the floor and I had it hidden and he took it anyways and he when I yelled at him to put it back, he threw it at me. So when he threw it at me, it got all over the carpet. So um, I got most of it out, like the smaller portions, but there's a huge portion that's still really, really, really blue and it won't. I tried my carpet cleaner, tried dish soap, I tried just blotting and it just won't come out. So I don't know what to do. It looks so bad. So like, it's still like right here. Like I got the other two spots to pretty much go away, but this like just won't go away. Um, so I don't know what to do. It looks so bad. Tips on getting paint off the carpet, let me know. Landon is at a stage of where he's just nothing but trouble. Okay, so we are currently outside. It's like finally cooler out, so it's like nice to be outside for a little bit. It's been like extremely, extremely, extremely hot. Um, but it's like 3.30, I think it's almost 4. Um, and Landon's just playing. Yeah, we're just hanging out. It's like really about the storm right now, though, like, look. <laughs> so, we are just trying to get some outside playtime, release some of their energy. Both boys napped for like an hour and a half. <laughs> yeah, you did. You wanna see what Asher can do now? Ready, go, Asher, go. Go. <gasps> go. <gasps> Oh, now you're not going to do it because the camera's on you? Hmm? He usually goes, <gasps> all day long. <gasps> Go. <gasps> Super baby. Let's go see what Landon's doing. I think he's inside. Yeah. How does that feel? You don't have any pants on. <laughs> uh, don't put it all over you. Why is there a lawnmower inside your trampoline?
Hello, so right now I'm about to make some dinner for me in Landon. Just pinched myself and it freaking, oh, I'm bleeding. No, I'm not, just pinched myself. Um, so we're gonna make some HelloFresh. I've been doing HelloFresh for a couple of weeks now and I love it. It's super easy to try new things. It is a little pricey. Um, I really like doing it when, oh, what's going on? I really like getting my boxes when I get like discounted boxes. Um, with that being said, I'll leave my link down below so you guys can sign up if you wanted to and get some money off. Um, I think it's about like $10 off you can get off your box or something. Um, I really like it. It's nice to like... It's really nice to try like new things and switch it up. Um, I, at first, was like, I'm not going to keep doing this. And my husband left on deployment. Okay, close your mouth, please. My husband left on deployment and I'm still ordering it for me and Landon. Today we are doing, or tonight we are doing pulled pork fiesta bowls. Um, yum. No, no, no. We actually had some, what's it called? Like shred, taco shredded chicken, like last week. Um, that I made in the crock pot. Excuse me, excuse this one. Wait, watch out. Um, so, this is kind of the same thing, but on the stove top. I don't like cilantro, so I'm just gonna throw that in there. Um, so yeah, first thing it says is to boil in a small pot three cups of water and some butter. And I already have it over there. One thing I feel like with HelloFresh is all the serving sizes are pretty friggin' small. I will say that. This is supposed to be for two people, and this will definitely be me and Landon, and then maybe lunch tomorrow. So, I mean, I don't know. If you eat a lot, I would say get four servings, but... Well, why would you squish it? You just squish the tomato. I don't like tomatoes either, so I'm gonna put that in there. Yeah, like plenty of time. Yeah, like in the face. Um, onion, mince, a few slices until you have two tablespoons. Mince it. Serve what? Uh, for the salsa. Well, I'm not going to make the salsa because the salsa is tomato, onion, and cilantro. I don't like tomato and I don't like cilantro, so I'm not gonna make the salsa. Um, so I'm just going to have all. I'm going to just thinly slice it. So we have the final look. So it looks so yummy. Lost we held right now. He just finished eating some butternut squash. So let's taste test this. Some rice and pork. Mom, eat. Mom, eat. Mm. Really good. Really, really good. Wanna try some? Wanna try some? Mm. Here, bite. It's not hot. Is it good? Oh, I'm sorry, it has sour cream on it. He doesn't like sour cream. <laughs> sorry, but yeah, so like I said, this post is not sponsored. Don't spit it on my food. Um, like I said, this video is not sponsored, but it is really, really good. Um, so definitely check out the link below if you want to try some. Right? Mm -hmm. 